If you ever watched the movie Inception, where it was about dreams in a dream, in a dream, in a dream, in a dream. In fact, team, cue the Inception music right now. We'll stop. Not too long until it gives us copyright issues. But imagine that. Okay, let's cue it again. Okay, stop. But instead of being in a dream, in a dream, in a dream, it is a prompt that creates more prompts, that helps you create more prompts, that helps you create prompts at an unlimited level. That's what this video is all about. Now, why is this video crucial? Is because far too many times I hear people saying, oh man, I want to be able to utilize ChatGPT, but the output either sucks, the quality is bad, it's not giving me what it is that I want, or I have trouble thinking about the prompt to feed into ChatGPT. So if you don't want to be able to create basic prompts and instead create really good targeted prompts that gives AI context and ultimately what it is that you want based on the quality that you want, then make sure you watch this video till the very end. Because by the end of this video, I'm going to give you the master prompt, the prompts that helps you create more prompts, that helps you create more prompts, that helps you create more prompts, unlimited levels, unlimited depth. Okay, so let's head over to my screen right now and I'm gonna to explain to you this prompt, okay? And it's basically this. It says, I want you to become my prompt creator. Your goal is to help me craft the best possible prompt for my needs, okay? This prompt will be used by you, ChatGPT. Now, I know this prompt is pretty long, okay? I'm gonna give you the prompt if you stay to the end and if you behave, okay? If you behave, you there's a 3.3367% chance that you might get the prompt and I'll show you how to get it. But the first part is I'm telling them, I'm telling ChatGPT again, I'm setting up context and I'm saying, you're gonna be my prompt creator, okay? And you're gonna utilize this following process. The first one, number one, is your first response will be to ask me what the prompt should be about. I will provide my answer, but you will need to improve it through continual iterations by going through the next steps, okay? So what I'm doing is, I'm telling ChatGPT to ask me what my prompt is about so that I can improve and just answer the questions, right? Number two, based on my input, you will generate three sections. Number one is the revised prompt. So you will provide a rewritten prompt. It should be clear, concise, and easily understood by you. So this is where I'm pretty much doing a reverse Uno type of card, and it's telling me the prompt that's gonna be understood by ChatGPT, okay? So a chat, a prompt that's easily understood by him or her, or they, them. I don't know, these days. I don't know what the pronoun is for, for ChatGPT, okay? I apologize if you, if, if you wanted to see a po politically correct pronoun for this. It's probably they, them, who knows, okay? Next, number two is suggestions, right? Provide suggestions on what details to include in the prompt in order to improve it. And number three, ask me any questions pertaining to any additional information that is needed from me to improve the prompt, right? So notice there's three segments right now, and you'll see why that is the case in a second. And then I said, we will continue to reiterate this process with me providing additional information to you and updating the prompt in the revised prompt section until complete. Now, full credit is, first of all, I did not come up with this prompt. This was a prompt that I found fascinating on some Discord server, okay? I tried to find out who the original person was that did this, which I thought was brilliant. If you know who it is, let me know in the comments below. But once I utilize this prompt, Let's take a look at what happens, okay? Let's get started. What should the prompt be about? Okay, so all I did was I fed ChatGPT this prompt. So all I'm doing is I'm gonna give ChatGPT a horrible, basic, broad prompt that most people who are clueless about ChatGPT and AI would write. So I would be like, here is the prompt. Help me write a Facebook ad targeting chiropractors. Okay, this is probably the most basic prompt that a person will typically write, right? And again, the quality of your prompt is going to dictate the, the quality of the output that you get, right? Gold in, gold out, crap in, crap out. Okay, so here it is. 
Now what happens now is, based on that prompt, here are the three sections, okay? Right, a Facebook ads that target chiropractic. So no nothing has happened just yet, right? It's still super basic. So it's giving me suggestions right now. You include a strong headline, right? Get more, such as get more patients through chiropractic marketing, right? It's telling me to utilize benefits, clear, concise. It could be image videos. Now, notice what's happening. It's asking me questions, right? What type of service or product are you offering to chiropractors? Okay, so maybe now I'm saying, all I'm doing is I'm answering the questions. I do acupuncture and dry needling, okay? No idea if that's what chiropractors do. I'm just totally making stuff up at this point, okay? But I'm guessing maybe some of them do, okay? But that's not a point over here, okay? So who's the target audience with the chiropractic community? 100%, it's gonna be the CrossFit community because they're hurting their back all day, every day, right? Chiropractors love them, right? CrossFit and bodybuilders and athletes. Athletes, okay? What sets your chiropractic apart from other marketing solutions? I don't know, I'm just gonna make something up. It's gonna be, I'm more expensive. <laughs> okay, so let's see if AI can do some critical thinking here and kind of relate it to a benefit, okay? But that's what sets me apart is I'm just more expensive. I'm more expensive and premium, okay? And I want to target rich people. Let's see what AI comes up with, okay? So, great. Ooh, it's not bad. It's, look at the revised prompt. Write me a Facebook ad targeting chiropractors who are interested in acupuncture and dry needling, as well as CrossFit athletes with premium marketing service that targets affluent customers. Okay, not bad, right? So now, notice how the prompt is kind of evolved a little bit than the basic prompt, okay? So this, who is this good for? It's good for those of you that don't even know where to begin, right? You, you don't know how to be more specific with your prompts. All you gotta do now is answer the question. So again, it's giving you different suggestions, multiple ad sets, right? It's telling you, you know, how you can increase patient referrals, yada, 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 okay? Now, it'll be more questions, right? How, what specific marketing services do you offer for affluent customers, okay? So let's say this would be, we do a customized, so let's say X-ray scans and customized solution based on results. Okay, clearly I'm not a chiropractor, okay. How do you differentiate your services from other premium marketing solutions in the market? I don't know. We have a really nice lounge, okay. Again, what am I doing this? I'm testing this together with you guys, right? I've used this prompt before. The team utilizes this prompt, it's brilliant. But sometimes, you might not know the answer, right? You wanna be able to use AI to do some critical thinking for you, okay? In fact, I could just say, I'm not sure. We have a really nice lounge. Do you have any data or specific case studies? No. I'm literally creating this offer right now, okay? Okay, so notice what's happening. Again, Targeting chiropractors have a customized solution for x-ray scans, appreciate luxury experience, okay? So, notice that AI is able to tell, like, even though you are more expensive, it doesn't use that as like, hey, we are more expensive, right? But it's able to utilize critical thinking and say, you know, who appreciate a luxury experience, okay? So, comfortable lounge area, satisfied patient, yada, 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 utilize retargeting. So, these are the suggestions, okay? Now, notice now it's asking me more questions again, and this is what I mean by it will keep you evolving the prompt over and over again until however many levels deep, until you're satisfied the prompt. So if you're satisfied the prompt, now I can actually take this prompt, I can go to ChatGPT, open a new thread, and I can just say, and, and I just put my new prompt in here, okay? It says create a Facebook ad, da 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 da, targeting chiropractors interested in customized solution for the patient based on x-ray scans will be who appreciate luxury experience, right? So now it's like I have a prompt that is a lot more specific even though I might not know how to make the prompt more specific. And basically this is the prompts of all prompts to help you start that thinking process. And if you wanna be able to get access to this prompt, I'll probably copy and paste this prompt in either the description box below, go check it out, or in one of the comments. 
But as always, let me know how you intend to utilize this prompt, what your thoughts are, and if you truly want to get good at AI, be sure to binge watch this entire playlist that's appearing in front of your face in about 5, 4, 3, 2.